Hey you guys, Drum Machine Addicts are back today, and in this tutorial we're going to show you how to make your own personalized drum kit. So say if you've got your sample chopped up and everything, and you have some really tight drums you put with it, but for your next song you don't want to have to go through the process of having to find each sound in its respective folder, there's actually a way that you can put all these sounds into one folder and just drag over the program file when you want to make your next song. So if you look to my left right here, I actually have the MPC drum content that comes with the software pulled up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take each WAV file and I'm going to drag it over to a pad. And then I'm going to save the pad as a program and show you where to save the program so that you can access it for the next song you choose to make. So let's begin. Right now I'm just dragging over random sounds. It doesn't matter. Um, for your program, you can drag over whatever you want to drag over. So, let's see. Okay, now say these are all the sounds in my drum kit. My kicks, my snares, my congas, whatever you want to have. I'm going to change the name just so I can recognize it. This is the test drum kit because, you know, the video and whatnot. All right, so my test drum kit, I've got my drums. I want to use these in almost every song that I do. So what do I do next? Okay, simple. You go to the top of the screen, you go to file, and then you go to save current program. And after you go to save current program, for this video, we're going to save the program to our desktop. Now you see down here, you click the new folder button and we'll call it test drum kit or oh excuse me well it's saved all right now just to check let's go to our desktop see it saved it as T and all of our sounds are in there and so is the XPM file so now let's go back to MPC okay we'll go to our desktop and then there you see T all of our sounds are in there and so is our drum kit. So if we were to delete this from right here, all of our sounds are gone. All we have to do is reload our drum kit and voila. You can do that on any song that you want to. And from that point forward, you have your custom drum kit. You can do that for as many sounds as you want to as well, all the way up to group H. So that gives you 128 drum sounds and this excludes layering your drums, something that we'll get into in another video. But for this video, this, tu this tutorial is concluded, and this is how you make your own custom drum kit. Don't forget to subscribe, like a video, tell a friend to tell a friend, and we'll keep supplying you with content. This is Drum Machine Addicts, and we are gone. Thanks.